Okay, I'm going to show you how to change the diaphragm in a T3 or T5 Zodiac cleaner. First thing we're going to do is we're going to unscrew this. And then pull it out. If you have a new one from the factory, this part here will be really tight. And this is the part you need to get off to get to the diaphragm. You'll need a wrench like this here and a rag. So I'd wrap the front with the rag, get the wrench and give it a quick turn counterclockwise and that will loosen it up and then now we should be able to twist it and get it out and then we pull this out here and you'll see that I have this stem pipe now and I have the diaphragm what we're gonna do is we're gonna pull this piece off here it should come right off now it should be pretty easy you just push from the back you should be able to pull the diaphragm through and out Then we want to take the extension pipe we want to put it on the diaphragm like this. It should look like that. And then we'll feed it through the front of the part here. And we'll pull the extension pipe through like that. You want to line up the diaphragm with these two tabs. Push it in a little more. And then here in the back, you want to make sure we pull it toward the diaphragm. We'll see the edge of it. You should see the edge of the diaphragm like that in the back. And the front should look like this with the diaphragm connected in the tab. And then we just take this part here, we thread it back in. Make sure it's tight. There we go. And we'll drop it back in your T3, T5. And we'll tighten the outer extension. And there you go. Let me throw it back in and see if it works. And that worked fine. The T3 is moving good in the pool again.